Hi all, I hope you guys are doing great. Full of Indian shops. It's like a mini India here. In today's video, I'll be sharing delicious food recipes and I'm so excited to visit Little India in London. It's a wonderful place for shopping Indian saris, suits, jewelry and delicious Indian food. If you are new to my channel, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and like this video. That way I will know that you like the content what I create. I'm making nutritious vegetable roasties for breakfast. I soaked one cup of rice overnight. Sometimes if I forget to soak it, I soak it in the morning for an hour. That'll do. I'm going to blend the rice with a piece of ginger and one green chili. If you want more spicy, you can add more green chilies. Batter needs to be really thick, so I'm adding only a little water. I'll be adding 2 tablespoons of sour yogurt. I've grated some carrots and then green capsicum, 2 types of capsicum, green and red capsicum, some coriander leaves and a bit of onions. Sometimes I add spinach also that we grow in our back garden. Salt, cumin powder, Batter is too thick, so I'm going to add a little bit of water. Half teaspoon baking soda. We'll be eating it with coriander chutney and ginger chutney. My friend Gayatri, Parthi and I are going to Southall for shopping Indian clothes and jewelries. And of course, lot of yummy Indian food. It's been raining since morning, but the weather side says it'll stop after 11. I'm really hoping for it. There are so many shops here. <laughs> We are spoiled for choices. Look at the lengas. Wow, I like this one. It's a multicolor lenga. It's nice, isn't it? They have so many shops here. So many shops of clothes and jewelry. It's amazing. It's still raining, but it's okay. We are braving the weather. We like Sherwani for now. Sherwani? and Sherwani. Look at the last one. Yeah. Which you want? This one? It's got a cape kind of thing. It's nice. I like it. Very nice. Every shop has very good quality. This whole area is full of Indian shops. It's like a mini India here. Every Indian has watched the movie Dilwale Dilhaniya Le Jayenge. <laughs> the movie is set in London. It follows the story of Simran and Raj who are born in London. I watched the movie when I was in my teenage, before ever coming to London. The one thing I learned from the movie was, if you miss India, if you get homesick and you want the taste of India, then go to Southall. It is mini India here. There is color everywhere, flowing saris and suits of pink, green and red shimmering with sequins. It's amazing here. Pile upon pile of intricately patterned silk scarves. I really love those scarves. They have these street food stalls everywhere. See, they are selling chart items, so many delicious stuff. It is so lovely to be here. 
rows and rows of glittering bangles of every hue imaginable all colors are here shining gold chokers necklaces and jhumkas you name it they have it this is south hall's main shopping street it's got absolutely everything you can think of just walking here in this broadway street takes me closer to home we are enjoying so much here this yellow dupatta is really good i'm going to see if we can buy it separately see if you buy this you can wear it for any dark color it's multicolored but i'm going to check it out in a minute wow loads of jewelry this is 1 pound 50 each i think these are bracelets yeah they are shiny crystals lovely let's we'll see if we can get any matchings lots and lots of bangles <laughs> all different colors every imaginable color and hues they've got it lovely necklaces stone necklaces gold type necklaces i saw there are many gold shops as well real gold shops it's a lovely place you get everything i think even for wedding you can get everything here indian clothes jewelry accessories everything this handbag is on sale it's only 5 pounds down from 10 pounds ethnic handbag you get a whole set of items it's a lovely shopping complex there are few shopping malls like this when you come inside you see a lot of indian shops and there are shops on the main broadway street as well wow. this is flower garland which you put it on your hair see <laughs> another multicolored dupatta I've been looking for this for quite a long time. I'm seeing a lot of them. Let me shop around to see if you shop around you'll get it for a cheaper price. That's exactly what we are doing. <laughs> All these chart items, poppy chart, bell puri, they've got everything. We are looking for jalebi as well. I want to eat jalebi, fresh hot jalebis. She's making fresh jalebis for us while we are waiting. It is so nice to watch her making it. It's a craft. It's an art, isn't it? It's lovely. I wonder how they get it. It's the experience, I guess. I can never get the shapes right. <laughs> It's really nice. The aroma is amazing. We are waiting here to eat it freshly. We bought some karak chai from Chai Wala. It is so nice. We enjoyed it so much. It just felt like we were having this chai in an Indian street. This place really looks like India. Party was saying. We are at Reeth Rivers. It's inside the shopping mall. They've got lots of collections here. The price is also reasonable. Let's check it out here. How much is this? Hundred and nine pound. Oh, hundred and nine pounds. This is really nice, guy. Yeah, it's so nice, so pretty. It's very nice. She was stuck on it, yeah. <laughs> She wanted it. <laughs> We are looking to eat lunch somewhere. Lots of chaat items. Maybe we'll be eating some chaat for lunch. <laughs> we don't come here every day, so we want to try different things. Jalebi Junction. They've got lots of sweets. Kajal halwa, bajis, different bajis. Lots of lovely Indian delicacies. There is Chandni Chowk there. Maybe we might go there. Rita Sweets is also there. Gurudwara. Saint Hall Gurudwara. There is Rita Sweets here. Yeah, it's there. Ah, chili chat corner. We try there. Chandni Chowk is also there. Is this 
Charmini Chuck? Yeah, Charmini Chuck, London. They said there is more seating upstairs. Chili burger, chili paneer. Bail puri? Who wants bail puri? Uh, samosa chat? shopping so much and eating such lovely food some of the indian snacks these shops are selling you won't find them even in many restaurants the variety of what's on offer is just incredible some street stores are much less traditional than i spot one that sells 10 kinds of non bread including nutella naan walking the broadway is intoxicating noisy vibrant and also delicious this is Gurudwara. I haven't been there, but I would love to go there sometime. I've heard they provide free food for everyone. They prepare the food fresh in the kitchen there and serve everyone who visits. When we lived in West London, we used to come here for Indian grocery shopping, quality food shop. <laughs> I'm making crispy chicken cutlets for dinner. I'll be covering the chopping board with a cling foam. I use the non-PVC cling foam. It's biodegradable. If you want, I'll give you the link below. Cover the chicken with another cling foam. You need to really flatten the chicken. If the chicken piece is really flat, then the cutlet will be very crispy. I'll show you what I use for my chicken cutlet masala. 1 tablespoon tandoori masala, 3 grated garlic pots, lemon zest. This gives your cutlet a nice refreshing flavor. Salt, 1 whole egg. I'll be marinating the chicken pieces and leave it in the fridge for half an hour. This cornflakes is for the crunchy outer layer of cutlets. I'm using smoked paprika. It gives a sort of barbecue flavor. The smoky flavor gives the feel of a Mexican recipe. I'll be doing a shallow fry.
it needs to cook 8 to 10 minutes on one side and about 5 minutes on the other side. It has to cook in medium flame. Someone's 